Hello guys, welcome to my channel, Alpha9 here, and today in this video I will talk about the FCR in details, about the basics, in my own words. I'm not a military pro or a real pilot, it's just my words. So let's start. FCR basically is a unit, can be mounted on the Apache, which is stand for fire control radar and it's this unit here this is the FCR and the way you mount it is you need to set it or mount it in the MMA slot when rearming so keep that in mind and you also need the Lima version of the Hellfires I don't know if the K will work I never tried but I don't think because the Lima version is a radar version so you need to make sure you have the Lima version now let's start the FCR as you can see here on this monitor we have the buttons around one of those monitors are uh, is the FCR you will press the FCR and it will come this uh, screen FCR not powered the first thing to do is go to utility and to the MMA here instead of pinned you need to set it to normal now FCR will take uh, some times to turn on basically I would do this and wait if I'm flying on the way to my target but there is a cool feature here where you can override this by clicking FCR bit override like this click FCR again and you will see this once you see this 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 is the range of your radar the range of scan now we need to select the FCR site the way you do this we go to controls and you need to change or keybind the site select switch FCR left this is important otherwise it will not work once I press that as you can see now this is changed from HMD to FCR we are on a working FCR now we can start scanning what keys you need is uh, we need the FCR scan switch single and we need the FCR scan switch continuous I don't use the continuous single is more than enough for me now once I press the single as you can see uh, some targets appeared in here this area here or rectangle will tell you how much targets detected we have six targets but if we check out this uh, monitor here we see nothing now this monitor will will uh, take the data from the TADS the FCR so now we are using the FCR it shows here a cool feature in the FCR is the C scope if we check this button here you see that you have some symbols on your uh, monitor here of course we're still not locked the FCR is locked but I will show you a cool trick now to identify your target before firing if you go to controls we have something called RHG site select switch link basically what this does if we press it check this out the monitor locked on the target it by itself and this is cool when it comes to identifying targets if it's uh, destroyed or if it's a friendly I saw lots of people attacking the same area 
and when there are multi uh, Apaches or Kiowas or stuff like that the FCR will not recognize friendlies from enemies you need to keep this in mind so basically if you lock on target it could be a friendly when you sh fire your hellfire it will hit friendly so the link is a good way to identify the target before firing because hellfires can kill apaches and kiowas believe me now once we locked six targets here we can start firing make sure that your uh, armament is arm and also what you need is to select your hellfires and you can start firing now what we have also here we have the, the zoom feature the zoom basically will give you this uh, rect angle which which you can move around with your cursor selection let me just show you the keys it's basically cursor control up up down left and right you also need the control the cursor display select uh, button deep press and <coughs> you will need the cursor enter deep press as you see I can move it here and once I'm here I will click the deep press and it zooms in we have more space between the targets I can see which target I want to start with now in general my information that FCR will set priorities to targets and it will set the highest priorities to anti-air units let's get back to the monitor here and with the cursor I can change my target <clears throat> let me show you I can move between targets now as you can see we have symbols this is a circle this is a, um, a rectangle so the major target will be a flipped rectangle the next target will be a shape of um, triangle let's fire at the targets fire out fire 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 and fire as you can see it's so effective to the point if you have an eight targets locked in with the FCR can't be destroyed in a row <clears throat> this is on fire I know that this one didn't uh, get any hit now sometimes it feels that the FCR uh, scan can be weakened by trees buildings and stuff like that so keep this in mind Also a nice trick guys the higher you are the best for you for your FCR for your weapons but it will make you so exposed to enemy radar keep this in mind I will go higher here to have a better view and also will show you that you can use the rockets Copy. and the Coming cannon up. with the FCR I will move in to get 
in the rocket range I believe it's 3.5 but the closer you are the better and also keep in mind that rockets are an area of effect weapons so it and does not it's not accurate I wish if we can use uh, the rockets that been set to the Kiowa but that would be unfair to be honest Okay, as you can see, we are in 2.9. The range is here, guys. This is the range uh, of your target. Let's select the rockets. You need to go to your weapons here and select the type. On speed. Now, the rocket indicator is off the target a bit. So, if I fire, rockets will not hit the target. You need to make sure that it's uh, at the middle of the target here aligned with this site to have the best chance the way I do this I go to the combat mode here and ask George to align with the target with the W key aligning. now he's aligning he's doing a great job in with this so let's fire a couple of rockets and see some just go away <laughs> far away drop uh, that's that's okay let's try with more as you see here it's not accurate uh, one hit that's fine now let's change to the cannon and see I don't like to set the cannon to certain amount so I go to the cannon here in the weapons and will select all so I will keep uh, <coughs> excuse me you keep holding the button it keeps firing before I do this let's change to another um, target here <clears throat> as you can see here we have a BTR I fired a hellfire and it missed it so let's try with the cannon And he's trying to run and yeah this is it guys this is the main idea of the FCR um, I hope you find this video useful please subscribe like the video if you have any question any comment any tip please leave it in the comment section until next time stay safe keep flying and we'll see you the next one peace